is Kelly Cahoot from incahootsdesign.blogspot.com. I have a quick haul video to share with you today. I got a package from catscrappiness.com and in my order I got some score tape. These are the 6x6 six six sheets, double sided adhesive, and you can both glitter these and emboss these. So I'm anxious to try these if you glitter over and then cut your die cuts, say Merry Christmas or Happy Birthday or anything like that. So I'm excited to try these sheets. And for glitter, I picked up the Nuvo Pure Sheen Glitter. And I want you to see how much product is in this. This is the Scarlet Red. And this is the Glitter Diamond. So these would be awesome to pick up if you're doing Christmas ornaments or Christmas cards because um, there's a lot of glitter in there. And then I also picked up some of the Nuvo embossing powder. This is called Gold Enchantment, and I want to compare this brand with some of the other well-known brands that we all use, whether it's Wow or Zing or Ranger. So I'm anxious to try that. And then I got some Dovecraft dies. I got numbers and a little happy birthday. And I thought these would be awesome to add numbers onto, you know, kids' birthday cards. So those are cute. And then the Neat and Tangled box die. This makes a little 3D box that you can make things pop out of the top on your cards. So that's going to be fun. And then Maria Russell on the Cat Scrappiness design team used this set. This is the Frosty Fairy Friends from Lawn Fawn. And she actually did a fall card with this that was so cute, but it's it's meant kind of for Christmas and winter. There's Christmas lights and snowflakes and pine branches and little holly berries, but um, she used it for fall, so you could use it, you know, all winter long. Cute, and the fairies have little earmuffs. Super cute. And then I got a lot of uh, neat and tangled. This says, you are uh, my most favorite. And this would be awesome for birthday cards or thank you cards. I love that. And I love their fonts. And I've been waiting for this set. I love this. This is the Little Baby Jesus, the stamp and the die. And I love that the hay cuts separately from the Little Baby. So you could ink blend or use your Copic markers or colored pencils and have two separate pieces there. And I love the little greetings. Oh, come let us adore him. There's little stars. And then all of the little images have dies as well. And then also picked up the Warm Wishes set from Neat and Tangled. And I love the little coffee or cocoa mug. And again, their font is really pretty. And I'm really excited to use these. These are die cuts and more, and they're layered stencils. I wanted to show you how these work. <clears throat> so you have your little boxes there, and then you can layer, you know, color one over the other. So there's that one, and I also got I think this is like a peacock feather. So you have the the bigger part there, and then you can layer. It goes there in the middle of the feather area to layer more color on top. So those are going to be fun and new to play with. And then I also picked up this die cuts and more stencil that's balloon, but it doesn't only have the stencil but it also has the negative space so um, you could color around it or mask it off. Super cool. And then I got so Momento Tuxedo Black. I needed a reinker. And then I'm so excited to try this new heat tool from Wagner. This is my old heat tool. And it's just an inexpensive one from Hobby Lobby. So I'm excited to see how precise this gets to your product or your uh, projects 
so it doesn't warp your paper as bad. So I'm excited to try that. Anyway, thank you guys for joining me today. This is Kelly Kahoot, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye-bye. Thank you.